Hi everyone, welcome back to Mum and I. Uh, it's the newly created channel. It's going to be predominantly uh, kids up stuff. So it is going to be a lot of things for the children to occupy them. Uh, once I get creating more and more of these videos, what you can then do is backtrack. Um, so it might give you up to an hour of entertainment for the kiddies. So please do share and subscribe because it's really important that if I'm creating these people are watching them. I am a children's entertainer so hopefully there will be some amazing things. Tomorrow I'm going to be looking at bubbles and creating your own bubble wands and there's a couple of things that you can do um, to enable you to do that but I am going to have the most amazing fun doing some bubbles outside because the weather at the moment is fantastic. So get the kids outside and um, everything that I show you should be a household thing that's already in stock. But today we're going to be looking at those exercise techniques and um, but I'm by no means um, qualified to do um, exercises whatsoever. I don't have that qualification. So it is really just for fun. So do be careful. If you are not used to doing exercise, then it's always recommended that you get some um, medical advice on that. But um, what basically I'm going to be showing you today is just some stretching exercises to just to warm yourselves up. And um, yeah, kids, you've got to stay tuned because coming up very, very soon is something specifically for you guys to do. But we can all do this. So kids, you can get involved in a, a warm up as well. So let's get on and let's just get that warm up done. Here goes. OK, so the first thing that we're going to do is just some gentle stretching down to the floor. But be very, very careful. If you're not able to reach the floor, then don't just go, um, just go to your comfort point. OK, let's do it. That took me three attempts to actually get to the floor and that's absolutely fine you go at your own pace um yeah so what you can do as well is hover over any areas that cause you a little bit of pain and um, so just stay there just hover for a little while so it's kind of like a super stretch in that position before you go all the way down to the floor and even when you're coming back up if you can still feel that pinch just stay there for a little bit longer and then come up so I'm just going to carry on now and I, I want to do about three sets of ten and really give my, my body a really good stretch this morning I am feeling a bit stiff and um, so yeah I'm going to get on with that but the next exercise is coming up for you guys straight away Okay, so next up are side bends, but don't overstretch, just go at your own stretch pace, don't, don't go too far if you can't. But keep trying, because you might find that you can get further the more you do. So it's just so simple. So basically, we're doing the roll down that we did at the beginning and then we're adding on so just watch carefully here it goes Hi kids, so this bit's for you. This is one of the fun things that we're going to do today. Uh, you need to take your shoes off by the way because what we're going to do is slip and slide. So if you've got wooden floors or stone floors, this is going to be so cool. Okay, you might have laminate floors, not sure what you've got, lino even, anything like that. This is going to be so cool. Three, two, one and slide! <laughs> fantastic and what I want you to do is a competition okay so if you've got siblings and even the adults could get involved if you want but you can practice first give them a little bit of a break but practice first how far can you slip and slide here goes one more time and slide <laughs> fantastic fun i've got another thing for you today as well um so do stay tuned okay so the last one we actually need to use the sofa and what i'm doing is i'm still stretching this area out here this really big area it's fantastic exercise for me so here goes 
this out. I literally get it onto the sofa. Some of you might only be able to do this to begin with. And then we just lean into it. Okay, so we really are trying to stretch this area here. But what I tend to do, because I've been doing it a while, is I put my whole leg on here and then I stretch into it. And I do this for one minute. And then when I've finished, I do the other opposite leg. We always do the opposite side because we don't want to leave anywhere wonky. That's not a good look at all. Right, and finally, children, what I want you to do is please, please, please get fit. It's really important, but I want you to get fit and have fun. So how do we do that? If you've got a wee fit, I want you to get it out and I want you to jog, okay? So it'll be fantastic because you can actually jog on a, on a route. So it will show you some fantastic things along the way. And I want you to try and beat your last jog. So it's really important that you try and do this every day. So go on the wee fit, do your jog and try and beat your timings and build up your stamina. So that's something that I really want you to do. And I want you to talk to me. I want you to tell me, did you go on the wee fit? And how far could you run? And how long? did it take you to do it and you could be at the top of my leaderboard in fact if you're the only one that responds you will be at the top of my leaderboard so I need you to tell me how far did you run how fast did you do it what was the length of time that you did it in uh, how old are you and what's your name that's it so have a go at that have fun that's what this is about exercise keeping fit and doing something okay occupying ourselves but how great to actually do that on a fantastic piece of equipment so whatever you've got it doesn't even have to be the wee fit just try to think outside of the box and um, you could even just literally look at your, your clock yeah or, or get an app that can do that for you but let me know keep me informed tell me what you're doing because it's really really important to me and to the community let's get these competitions going so let's start with our very first competition and that is how far can you run how long is it going to take you and it's particularly aimed at the kids this one I'm really important really really important to me um, um, that you communicate that with me and tell me how you're doing and just try and beat your last score and let's be honest if somebody else beats your last score you're gonna have to have a go the next day and try and get back on top um, but I want to see these as well you can't just tell me if it's on the we fit take a screenshot and let me have a look at how you're doing how you're performing let's be really honest about this and um, let's get cracking so have fun with these exercises guys and I'm going to be doing these daily and putting them out around about one o'clock just so that you all know um, you've got that sort of thing to look forward to. And um, the kids might start to get excited. You know that once you've had your lunch, uh, you can then play this and see what I'm up to. So yeah, tomorrow is bubbles. Have fun with this. These were just, um, these were just our stretching out exercises so nice warm-ups we're going to do a little bit more on um, the types of equipment that you can use in your own home that's accessible and um, that's going to be crazy but really good there's a lot of things that you can use in your home to help you to exercise so that one will be next week so do look out one o'clock daily at the moment and we'll just see how it goes but please please do give me the thumbs up if you're liking these uh, press the like press the subscribe button and really important that you press your notification bell because you need to be um, not missing any of these because they are hopefully going to be fantastic. All right, stay safe out there until tomorrow. Bubbles, um, over to you guys.